Kevin Fletcher Brown with another artist video blog at kicks96country.com. Our guest today all the way from Nashville, Tennessee, by way of the great state of Texas, please welcome Macy Martin. Macy, how are you? Very good. Nice to be here for welcome sure. Welcome to Kicks 96. Most definitely. Thanks for having me. Okay, now you're... Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and start with the obvious. Okay. You're only 16. Oh yeah, only right. 16. But in the last, you know, at least 10 years of your life, you've done some pretty impressive things for a young woman your age. Mm -hmm. All right, um, Thank you're you. you're singing and writing your own music. Mm -hmm. um, you perform for like Miss uh, Miss Tennessee, uh, Miss Texas, yes, uh, Miss Alabama pageant. Um, you you've written your own debut EP. Mm -hmm. All right, you with self, different co-writers. Yes, yes. you self-published. And you're you're being produced by Kent Wells, is that yep. correct? Yes, Kent sir. Wells, of course, a, a famous for Dolly Parton, producing Dolly Parton. Um, so let's talk a little bit about you. What part of Texas are you from? I'm from the Bryan College Station, Texas area. So of mm -hmm. course, Texas A&M University. <laughs> we laughed about coming to Alabama. We said, "Oh, we're not going to say much about that." <laughs> it's okay. I'm breaking. <laughs> now that we're all in the SEC, it's oh, okay. Oh yeah, we're no, okay. it's okay. Well, and you know, I'm breaking the family lineage anyway, and I'm going, <laughs> I'm going off to either Vanderbilt or Belmont. So mm -hmm. it works. It works. But um, I did. I started singing publicly more when I was about six years old. And I did. I sang for a local pageant. And I was the guest entertainment for a while. The girls got changed back. At stage. six? Yeah, yeah. At six? Okay. <laughs> yeah, and I sang A Part of Your World from uh, The Little Mermaid. Mm -hmm. And I've always been a Disney fanatic, so that worked out great. And yeah, and now, ten years later, I'm just keeping on doing it and loving every single bit of it. Music is a passion. Well, okay, mine. so you're you're singing, you're writing, you're yeah. playing. When do you have time for school? Well, that's the question. <laughs> all my friends and all my family, they look at me sometimes and they go, you know, have you lost your mind? How do you do all that you do? Because I am my very involved. I'm very involved in my Pay no attention to the man oh, just yeah, off yeah. camera. Oh, you know, no, no, no big deal. <laughs> but um, I'm very involved in my high school. Yeah. So a lot of people do. A lot of people ask how I, you know, handle it all. And I tell them, I really don't know. You know, I definitely agree that it's by the grace of God. You know, if he has a path and a plan for each of us, then he's going to allow it to prosper and come through. But also, um, also the fact I tell them, I have about, you know, three different lives. I have my high school life, my music life, and then pageant life, yeah. and community service life, all that kind of stuff. But I love every single one of them. <laughs> That's right. I mean, you do, um, you have extracurricular yeah. activities. You are involved in local pageants, things like that. Yeah. Uh, how often do you travel to Nashville? Um, about, it depends on what projects we're working on. You know, this summer I've been dedicating my summer toward my radio tour, so working in with that with Nashville. And then uh, throughout the fall, Kent will call us up and we'll work on some material throughout the fall. And we'll just kind of work around holidays and weekends. And my school is really good about working with us and working in times that we can come in as well. All right, not only are you uh, a student, obviously, mm -hmm. a very good student, uh, a, a talented singer, songwriter, and performer. You're also, um, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> um, is, uh, what's that word? That, oh, is it philanthropist? Mm -hmm. You're a philanthropist. Macy's Toy Box. What is yeah. Macy's Toy Box? Okay, Macy's Toy Box. Being surrounded by the pageant, so that, like the pageant that uh -huh. I performed at, what I was, I was called a Lone Star Princess. And it's a mentoring program that the Texas pageant and even the national pageant offer to young girls ranging from um, the age of about 6 mm -hmm. to 13. And so as like a local title holder is what I was last year, I mentor a young girl, and she gets to see all that I do throughout my community and serving and fulfilling my platform, and so I was surrounded by that. And so at six years old, I found a Macy's Toy Box back in the second grade, and what it is, we collect gently used and new toys for children in need, and I really try to encourage others to get involved. The, so that goes back to Tumbles, and mm -hmm. Tumbles is available for purchase on my website, uh, MacyMartinMusic.com, where people can get involved because he acts as a monetary donation toward Macy's Toy Box to cover shipping and purchase of new toys if we donate to a hospital or something. And then also people have the option of donating him back. Wow. Yeah. So, and she's only 16, and I haven't <laughs> done even any of those things. <laughs> well, it's easy any. to get involved. So, I mean, I'm just saying. It's, anyway, <laughs> so let's, let's talk about the music, okay? Okay, okay. You've got your single, Me With You, that's, uh, that's out now. That's one yeah. that you co-wrote. Uh, tell us about that single. Okay, well that single, I wrote it with my co-writer who's here, Bill DeLuigi, and um, that song, it was kind of a mishap song. I wasn't supposed to write with Bill again that night, 
And my uh, second co-writer, he accidentally double booked himself. So we called up Bill, we wrote together again around 10 o'clock at night. And this song, we had so much fun with it. You know, it didn't seem like it had been a long day or anything. It's truly my personality, who I am. It's got fun little quirks in it and stuff about dipping, dipping your french fries in a chocolate milkshake. And it talks a little bit about Frank Sinatra because I'm a big Frank Sinatra fan and all about the Rat Pack and stuff like that. <laughs> yeah, I'm an old soul, but... Yeah, it's just got fun little stuff in it like that. Okay, yeah. so the, now the EP is its debut EP. It's, it's available now. Mm -hmm. There's six tracks, including the single "Me with You." Yes, sir. Um, where can folks get this if they want to get it? Okay, for a hard copy album, it's available on my website, MacyMarkMusic.com, as well as Amazon and other sites like that. But for electrical stuff and digital downloads, it's available on iTunes and there. And yeah. And what about your social media? Are you on Facebook oh, yeah. and Twitter? Most definitely. Instagram uh, and oh, yeah. Vine, and I can't keep up with all of them anymore. <laughs> I know, yeah, right? You probably invented right? at least one. Oh, oh, no, no. I mean, you're doing everything Te else. Oh, but technology, see, that's where, uh-uh, oh, really? that's not my thing. We have found her kryptonite. <laughs> there you go. Technology, that's it, that's it. <laughs> MacyMartinMusic.com, look for her on Facebook and Twitter. Yes. And social media. Macy, thanks so much for being oh, here. Oh, thanks so much for having right, me. Look for a live performance of uh, her and Bill, the guy who's throwing instruments around just off camera. <laughs> that's uh, her co-writer. Uh, they're going to do a live performance elsewhere on the website. Look for that. And uh, make sure you join us here next time. Maybe we can get her to come back and oh, yeah, bring some yeah. more interesting stuff with her. Macy Martin is our guest today, an artist video blog on Kicks96Country.com.